Attention! Attention! What? <gasps> Miss Maria will see you now. Allie, you do not have to continue to do that. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Madison, you really caught my eye last week. I mean, there were so many women out there in that ring. Things could have gone badly very quickly. Very quickly. So thank you for stepping up. Maria, I didn't do that for you. Hey, wait a second. Do you? This is Miss Maria. Do you know who you're talking to? And do you know who I am? Hi, Madison Rain. Nice to meet you. I was and am the queen bee of the knockouts. And ever since you came here, I've been pushed aside so that your beast of a champion and your chipmunk of an assistant could be star players. Gail Kim deserves to be in the Hall of Fame, but I wanna know what you're gonna do for me when I beat her. Well, I guess we're just going to have to wait and see if you beat Gail Kim. but this was the scene we saw last week. Madison Rain would take out her longtime friend, Gail Kim, a blindsided attack. And the reason being is because Maria, the leader of the knockouts, said that anyone that can stop Gail Kim on her quest to become knockouts champion will be handsomely rewarded. Gail has to win here. Anytime that you're gonna stab your friend in the back, for the almighty dollar. It's disgusting, and I'm disappointed in Madison Rain. Let's we'll see if Madison Rain can stop Gale on her quest to become a six-time knockouts champion and tie for the record with Angelina Love. Excited to see this knockouts match. I'm also excited as Gale goes for the cover here about Impact's New partnership with Pro Wrestling Tees. You can go to ProWrestlingTees.com right now, find your favorite Impact Wrestling athletes, including Broken Matt Hardy, Jeff Hardy Decay, and more. T-shirts of your favorite Impact stars. Official shirts at ProWrestlingTees.com. Nice move by Madison. Nice cover here, Gail Kim down. And remember, Gail's fighting for her opportunity to challenge for the Knockouts Championship. Shoulders down uh, there Madison. Madison yeah, she's fighting for what, a bonus? And you throw your friendship out the window for a bonus? Well, she's gonna be rewarded handsomely, according to Maria, yeah. if she can beat Gail Kim. Oh, well, again, we're talking about the almighty dog. I mean, you know, what disgusts me? Well, that dog, poor cover and a kick out. It's not necessarily the fact that Madison Rain chose this path and she wanted to be the one to take out Gail Kim and, and be rewarded by Maria. It's just the fact that she could have did it face to face, saying, you know what, Gail Kim, I'm gonna take you out. This isn't personal, it's business. She and I can respect it. So your problem is the way Madison Rain conducted herself. Oh, she goes for another cover, tight. Because this is what we see every day, you know, in, in the business world. You know, just everyday working people getting stabbed in the back. Stabbed from their position, from their raise, from moving up into management. And you know, this is what's going on right here with Madison. She's trying to stop Gail Kim from going back to the knockout championship. And Gail Kim misses there, Madison Rain and Gail Kim. These two know each other very well. Step up in Siguri by the former five-time knockouts champion. Cover hooks the leg and a kick out at two. I think that people were very surprised that Madison Rain, though, betrayed Gail Kim. And speaking of betrayal, it is the lifeblood of wrestling. Get a second dose of betrayal tonight and every night of the week on Big Brother After Dark. Seven nights a week, live on Pop. Play or get played. Remember, Gail Kim has to win. She's got to defeat all the knockouts, or she'll never get an opportunity to challenge for the title again. Ooh. Gail Kim! Looking for that corner maneuver that she does often. Madison had it well scouted because they know each other so well. Oh, yeah, these two. Oh, two of the longest tenured knockouts in the company. Yeah, think about this. A few weeks ago, Madison Rain, as she goes for another cover here, hooks the leg, and Gail kicks out. Madison Rain wrote a very lengthy blog on ImpactWrestling.com about how much she respects Gail Kim. You know, and how much she learned from Gail. Yeah. Hey, Gail. Oh, man, used to say money talk, will crap walk. And uh, in this case, <laughs> Ronnie's definitely talking to Madison Rain Ash. I'd like to meet some of the elder popes. You guys always talk about bullfrogs and bullcrap. Madison Rain trying to stay in control here. 
sliding on, baseball clothesline. Yeah, See that from Madison what? Rain often. How many times have Pope referred to Madison Ooh. Rain in this matchup as Lil' Maddie? You know, I don't see her like that anymore. Oh, and Gail Kim counters. And now Madison Rain right out here in front of us. Trying to what? shake some feeling back into her arm. Madison has gotten in such great shape over the past year. I mean, she looks wonderful. And now Gail Kim counter. Madison Rain shoulders down. Pops free. And so we've already seen one semifinal match in the Bound for Glory playoff as EC3 has moved on to the finals against Matt Hardy. So EC3 awaits the winner of tonight's main event. Will it be the miracle Mike Bennett or will it be Drew Galloway? who joins EC3 in the finals, one step away from going on to challenge for the world championship at Bound for Glory this fall. So anyone's chance at this Ooh. moment. Anyone can go up to the next level. Look at Gail. And Gail caught the boot there of Madison Rain, who quickly trying to take advantage uh -oh. here. Rain check. Gail Kim shoulders down, and Gail wisely just grabs the bottom rope. Well, uh, normally that would be the end of the matchup, but the position in, of Madison Rain's rain check was just not in her favor. You know, if Gail Kim loses this match, I wonder what else Gail will be doing at Bound for Glory other than being inducted into the prestigious TNA Hall of Fame. Gail! Gail got her! Gail Kim's quest towards the Knockouts Championship will continue with a victory here over Madison Rain. Gail! So Madison Rain took the bait of Maria last week. She blindsided yeah, and assaulted Gail Kim. She thought, perhaps I could be six-time knockouts champion. But it's Gail Kim winning. It's Gail Kim moving on. It's Gail Kim getting one step closer to Bound for Glory and a sixth knockouts championship when she'll be inducted into the prestigious TNA Hall.